Many basements have insulated walls, but often overlooked are the rim joists. The rim joist is the perimeter of your floor framing system and can be the source of a lot of air leakage, which costs you money. The solution to this problem is to air seal and insulate the rim joists. What you'll need is a tape measure, a heavy duty box cutter, a straight edge, a step ladder, expanding foam, and rigid foam insulation. You'll also want to wear a safety mask and safety glasses. Now, while insulating a basement rim joist is not necessarily the quickest solution to energy savings, it's definitely one of the most effective and can be quite simple if you just follow these few steps. The first step is to measure the space between the joists. Measure both the height and width to ensure the foam board is cut correctly and will slide easily into place. The second step is to cut the rigid foam. Use your heavy duty box cutter and straight edge to cut the foam. Make sure you cut them an eighth of an inch less than your measurements. For the third step, grab your stepladder. If there's already insulation in place, remove this before applying the foam. Next, insert the cut foam in between the joists. It should slide into place relatively easily, leaving a little room between the foam and the joists along all of the edges. Step four is sealing the gaps along the outside of the foam board. Expanding foam works great for this step, as it not only closes the minor gaps between the joist and foam board, it also works well to seal large gaps for a tight fit around pipes, cables, or other obstructions. Once the expanding foam is in, you're set. You'll notice a substantial difference in how much warmer your basement stays in the winter, and your wallet will thank you too.